So what's this experience been like so far? Just from the start of getting here in Disneyland all the way up to now, what just for you specifically, what's it been like? Um, it's been crazy. I mean, we went to Disneyland, which is the happiest place on earth. I mean, we're in LA. Um, we're playing in the Rose Bowl, so it's the granddaddy of them all. And just, I mean, it's a big dream for a lot of people in this, in this room and on this team. How have the coaches uh, explained to you guys to, to keep focused in, in a game that has is that is as big as this and, and being in Los being in Los Angeles, going to Disneyland, having all this media exposure? Have you guys maintained a focus that this is just another game to practice for? I mean, like you, uh, like you said, the coaches are always saying this. They're always on keeping us on edge every time we see them. It's always, are you in your playbook? Are you ready? Are you know what to do and you know on certain downs and I mean so it's just always asking us if we know our stuff and um, just kind of keeping us on edge so your growth individually this year statistically from a season ago to now has jumped up ex ex extremely uh, talk about your growth this year and what you've seen in your gameplay from fall camp to now um, I mean it's just been paying attention to details uh, Kind of looking up to Jordan and asking him for help, uh, asking Coach Joe, um, and even asking Coach Avalos uh, just with our steps. And um, he, he teaches a lot with our steps with him, and then handwork with Coach Joe, um, and then just the little details with Fat Mac or with Jordan, um, and just just watching a lot more film and stuff. So. You mentioned Jordan and what you've learned from him. Uh, him and Austin both have a chance to maybe depart and leave early for the NFL. There's been talk about that. What would what would a hole that they would leave if they if they both potentially left next year? And, and what role do you think you could have on this team if those spots potentially are filled by you? Um, I mean, it's just the next man up mentality. Uh, that's what you always gotta have, whether it's uh, during this game or throughout the season. Everybody has that next man up mentality. So, I mean, if they decide to leave next year, then uh, next man up, and I would be gladly to take that position. So. What role do you think you could have with this team? Do you think you could be a vocal leader, or are you kind of guy that that sits back and what do you, what do you think your role you could have with this team? Or what role do you want to have with this team? Um, as of recent, I've been just kind of a person who sits back and listens. Uh, but I would definitely become a vocal leader if I, I need to, and uh, that's something I'll take pride in. What are things that you've learned from Jordan, Austin, the guys above you, or just or just all your all your teammates on on the defensive line? What are things that you guys learn from each other? Um, it, it's uh, it's like don't be afraid to ask questions. Uh, if you have something that you want to know uh, that you're unsure about, ask it. No, there's no stupid questions when it comes to the D-line room. Uh, and just like I've said before, the little things, the little steps. Uh, so yeah. Awesome, man. I appreciate it.